Hello, hello, hello to all of the Libras out there. Sun, so Moon, Rising, and Venus. Welcome to Visions of Light Love. This is your love reading for the energy in July. All right, if you are a returning viewer, welcome back. If this is your first time stopping by, welcome, welcome, welcome. And if the reading does not resonate with your situation, feel free to check out your Moon, Venus, and Rising Sign videos. Cross watchers are welcome as well. For a personal reading, the links will be posted in the description box below this video. And if you are interested in a Lions Gate portal reading, check the community section of the channel for more information. And shoot me an email and we will get you set up for the reading. All right, let's see. So Libras, you have love, dragonfly, and mirror. I definitely feel like you have a lot of love for someone. There's a lot of passion here. You may be holding on to the thought of being with this person, but something here in this union needs to heal. Something came to light, okay? You may have found out something about this person. The, they could be dealing with another person or this person could have put placed you in a third party situation. But I feel like something definitely changed in this union to cause you to go within and to to cause you to go within and to reflect on your actions or your part in this situation. OK, for some of you, you could have been engaged to this person in some type of long term commitment, possibly married to this person. But I definitely feel like there are some type of separation going to going on we have release your ex and then we have separation here so there's definitely something going on where you and this person are not together but i feel like in your separation or during your separation with this person you are having the opportunity to reflect on the relationship reflect on your part in the demise of the relationship and you are reflecting reflecting on <clears throat> how to rebuild or if you can rebuild this union okay let's see what else is here see what the tarot cards have to say comment in the comment section below and let me know if this is your story also hit the thumbs up image to help the video circulate and also to show me that you support this channel All right, so I feel like this person may have been a wish fulfillment for you or you are viewing this person as being self-centered, only thinking about themselves, having addictions. They could be addicted to alcohol. Someone here could be going out to the bar, getting drunk a lot at this time. Could be addicted to smoking. Just there's some type of addiction here. I feel like in the past... Okay, something happened there in this union to cause you to feel wounded. And it caused you to feel like with this nine of wands, you were feeling like you put a lot of work into this union, but you were the only one willing to put forth effort to make things work out between you two. And the result of that was you making a decision to walk off or separate yourself from this person because you were feeling defeated. You felt defeated in this union. It's like you tried to work on things with this person but something here just did not work out so right now um some of you could be dealing with an aries leo or a sagittarius but it's either someone here needs to put an end to um a third party situation or this is your person contemplating coming in to have a conversation or to heal the situation or to take this relationship to a higher level of commitment because something here has definitely come to an end. There is no movement here. And someone with this queen of wands is thinking about taking action to come in, but it's like the things are up in the air. This person is contemplating. They are trying to figure out if, would it be best for them to come in or leave things the way that they are. They don't really know how you're going to accept them 
if they come in. But let's clarify. Let's see why this death card. Let's see, first of all, who this Queen of Wands is. And then we're going to clarify this death card here. Who is this Queen of Wands for Libra? Let me know if this is resonating with your, uh, your story. Who is this Queen of Wands for Libra? Who is this Queen of Wands for Libra? <clears throat> Who? Okay. Yeah, someone from your past. This person wants to come in. You may have some type of soul tie with this person. Yeah, I feel like this person is like staying in the present moment. They are grateful for the relationship <clears throat> that you two had. And I feel like now that you've separated yourself, this person wants to come in and offer something stable. For some of you, you may reconnect with this person around the fall season. Could be a, a, a Taurus, Capricorn, or a Virgo. And I feel like what caused this relationship to end is the fact that someone here got too comfortable and stopped putting in the work, stopped putting, um, putting in effort, stopped showing love, started like closing their eyes to things that needed change, okay? That's what caused this union to come to an end. And during this separation, 